Welcome to our change tutorial on how to change the menu music. After this tutorial we will be able to change the, your menu music to anything you want to. So you will not have this copyrighted content. But rather this. Or this. Or maybe even this. And yes, we can have multiple files so it's different on each startup. So let's get started. First things first, we need to find the music we want trains to play. Be that something you have composed yourself or something off of YouTube, it's up to you. I personally play my own music when I'm playing trains, so I don't have music but rather sounds of trains as my menu music. Anyways, we need to have the music in .wav format. Download yourself a free audio editing software called Audacity. I have linked a handy in-depth tutorial about it if anyone is interested. But for the purpose of this tutorial, we just need the export function. Take the audio files that you have and drag and drop into Audacity. If you have multiple files, you will need to export them one by one. After dragging and dropping the files into Audacity, you would want to export it into WAV files. Export it somewhere you will find it easily, on the desktop for example. You can export as many as you want since I didn't find the limit as how many trains can play yet. You can keep the name how they are originally called, just without any space in between or call them something like Trends Menu Soundtrack 0 or how they are already called which is Menu Theme 0 Awesome! Now that we have our music we want we need to tell the game to play them Go to the Content Manager and find the asset called Trains Menu Sounds Open it in Explorer Take the nostalgic walk by Tim Brown and just throw it into the trash We don't need it anymore We've walked enough. Now take those files that we just exported and put them where that nostalgic walk was. Great! Now go to the config.txt file and now we need to tell the trains to play it. Take the file name that you renamed your file and place it there where it says 0. Every next soundtrack, just add a number higher, meaning 1 for this one and 2 for the next one. Also last step, don't forget to make this asset that we just edited obsolete the current one meaning find the container called quid and add a number higher than the current one to obsolete. If it has nothing at the back, we need to add a 1 at the end and a 2 after the quid to upgrade to a better version of quid. Nice! Now we can go ahead and copy the file path of the asset that we just edited, then go to the content manager and by selecting import content folders, we're going to import the folder that we have the new menu music in. This is going to obsolete the menu music that we previously had with the new music that we just created. It should look something like this. You can also just drag and drop the folder. Maybe that was easier to explain. But yeah, now you know how to do that both ways. And last step, fire up the game and enjoy your new menu music. Thank you for following through with this tutorial and I hope to see what you guys have come up with. Share some of your videos over in my Discord server, where you will also get help if you got stuck somewhere following along this tutorial. Other than that, stay awesome and beautiful and have a lovely day. Vidimasa!